Hi everyone, we have some great updates for you. Canvas apps now offer improved responsive design, easier control renaming, and a more intuitive variable viewer. Plus, there's an exciting enhancement to the plan designer that we think you'll love. Let's dive into the details in this month's edition of Parabs Pulse. Welcome back to the Paris Pulse, where we highlight quality improvements for your developer experience. First up, we have some updates to Canvas apps. You can now set the maximum width and maximum height for controls in responsive containers. You can fine tune exactly how much control shrink and expand to achieve the responsive behavior you're after. This enables you to build responsive layouts no matter what device is used. Whether users are viewing the app on the browser, portrait or landscape on their mobile phone, or even on a tablet, the controls in responsive containers will adjust. Let's next take a look at renaming controls through the tree view. Previously, when you wanted to rename and select text using your mouse, it would drag the control. We listened to your feedback and now you can drag and select part of the control name when renaming through the tree view. For the last Canvas app update, the variable viewer now displays variables in alphabetical order. Finally, let's take a look at an exciting update to Plan Designer. Many people have asked, how does Copilot decide which apps, flows, or agents to suggest? With this release, we're introducing a new reasoning section that gives makers a clear view into the why behind each recommendation. Our goal is to build trust and help makers better understand Copilot's decisions. If you'd like to share your thoughts, just click the thumbs up or thumbs down button in the reasoning section. The team is excited to hear your feedback. And that's it for this month's edition of Parabs Pulse. Comment down below of which feature will be an improvement to your developer experience. See you in the next one. Bye.